It's election eve and everyone is talking about tomorrow's midterm vote. SNL even tackled the topic with a fake PSA that might reveal how the Dems really feel about the so-called blue wave at the polls. Watch. It's a win we need and a win we're going to get. I'm sure of it. We're finally going to put this administration in check. We and all my friends can't wait to vote, so we'll see you at the polls next Thursday. Tuesday. I know, Mom, I'm kidding. It was not funny! <laughs> Well, we definitely saw a lot of confidence uh, a month ago from the Democrats thinking that there would be a blue wave coming. Do you feel as a Democrat that you're on pins and needles? Did that did that PSA kind of encompass how you feel or no? I think people had a lot of confidence with the last election and how that turned out. I think that we all know that people can say anything they want, but whatever happens in that voting booth stays in that voting booth. So people are a little worried. Erica and rightfully so I mean it, for me it's interesting because I took I voted this morning it took me about 45 minutes to like really go through every single thing and figure out which way I was going to vote um, it's quite complex because one some things are just completely obvious like the fact that in Colorado we voted whether or not slavery will still be in the Constitution um, <laughs> that's like obvious um, but then there were other ones that were like I generally would be liberal and more democratic and I could not support some of the propositions and some of the things that I was I had to vote on. So it's such a complex it's thing. Nuanced. Yeah, and I think that people really need to take take the time to know exactly what they're voting for or against. And, Hands I think, down. I, and a lot of glass ceilings possibly being shattered with I, women absolutely. and Native Americans and open LGBTQ candidates. Well, I just want to say what I think Erica just said was very important because I don't like people going there and just like, I'm Democrat, I'm Republican, I'm checking all these boxes without even knowing what you're checking which is probably because it's blue or red right but I like what you said you took your time a little bit to vote and you don't have to go all the way down on one side you could go to the other side for something else I think that's very important Jeff, I can I ask you a quick question are you intimidated when you guys go in there and like I'm like I don't know what issue 71 is yes I don't know, oh, what, yes. Issue 70, I don't know what proposition 14a is but see it's, that's the reason why you need to do your research and your homework you can walk in with a cheat sheet that Erica's is not a problem season, but what you can, and you know, and there's <laughs> so many I mean, independent it is, it is organizations though. that will explain Ow. what I your just, yes or no means. Yeah, and I'm sorry. No, I just <laughs> think it's important that people know that they should know this what they're voting on. This is more important than football of season. Of course it is. I know, you're Especially kidding. Especially since the Browns are out of it. But the Bears are I, in the first okay. place. Okay. So. Okay. You two are pissing no, me you, off. I, I completely understand what you're saying. It's just, I think it's intimidating. Most people that are juggling lives, you're moving into a new house. But it's your kids. future. It's a lot. I'm but saying, Al, I completely let, agree. Let me just throw this out here because this is what I was really thinking. Had I just decided to just walk into the voting place tomorrow and just do whatever, and I accidentally said, oh, no, I think slavery should absolutely be a part of our Constitution. Right. How do I look at myself again? Right. How do I look at myself again? I people, think people should be able to look at themselves after they vote. Right. Some people won't, might not even read that and know what they're voting for. So, like I said, very important. It is. Yeah. Yep. Educate yourself on every single policy and candidate. Sam's going to kill me. <laughs> That's true. <laughs>